Hi, my name is Danish Tafti. I'm a professor in the Mechanical Engineering Department at uh, Virginia Tech, along with my co-author uh, Hamid Hossein Zadegan. Uh, this particular paper, which has been published in the Journal of Biotechnology and Bioengineering, uh, reviews the state-of-the-art in computational modeling of thrombus formation and growth and uh, related phenomena such as platelet margination, activation, adhesion, and embolization. Uh, additionally, we also review the effect of uh, shear stress uh, on these phenomena. In this review paper, we have addressed issues that researchers come across when modeling thrombosis or thrombosis-related processes such as platelet margination, platelet activation, or embolization. The parameter values or constant in the models that are used or boundary conditions or the applicability of these uh, modeling techniques. We have specifically reviewed computational methods used for modeling platelet activation, including chemical and shear induced activation, platelet adhesion and aggregation, platelet margination, embolism, which is very crucial in heart attacks, device induced thrombosis, devices such as left ventricle assist devices or prosthetic heart valves, and thrombus growth in stenosis vessels that are very common in both arterial and venous flows. Also, we have introduced the most common blood viscosity models and developed formulas for the effective mass diffusivity of different blood components. The field of numerical modeling of thrombosis is moving in the direction of developing multi-scale modelings that include events happening on the scale of platelets as well as phenomena at the macro scale. Also, what seems to be missing in the literature is a lack of more predictive models that can replicate the experimental observations without the need for calibration under specific conditions. Please uh, take a look at our paper entitled Modeling from the Formation and Growth and contact uh, Dr. Tafti uh, if you have any questions.